Carrie, a Coretta Coretta Sea Turtle story, written, drawn, and read by Sean Johncott. Once upon a time, on a beach, in a nest, under the sand, there was an egg. In the egg, there was a baby sea turtle. The turtle's name was Carrie. When she was dreaming about swimming in the sea, suddenly she heard some cracking noises. Scared, Carrie tried to use her head to push out of her egg. Carrie made a crack too. She was not scared anymore. She kept making cracks in her egg. Soon, she made a hole. She tilted the egg, moving it from side to side. She wiggled out of it and took her first step into the world. Carrie saw other turtles around her in the sand. She asked one, who are we? And it told her, we are sea turtles, and our kind of sea turtle is called Carada Carada. Carrie got out of the nest. She saw many lights. She wondered which one the moon was, because Coretta Coretta turtles know they have to get closer to the moon. Carrie chose the highest light in the sky. It was the moon. She told all the other turtles to follow her, and they did. Carrie saw a big white bird flying over the beach. The bird was getting closer and closer to the baby turtle. Carrie was scared that the bird might eat them. She told everyone to move faster. She got to the sea. She dove down into the water so the bird couldn't get her. When Carrie looked around the sea, she was amazed. All around her, there were fish, crabs, and sharks. Carrie swam away. She saw something tasty looking, a juicy jellyfish. She bit into it, but for some reason, it tasted very bad. A grown-up Coretta Coretta with a colorful shell swam by. Carrie asked her, what was that thing I almost ate? The grown-up turtle said that it was not a jellyfish, but a plastic bag. People threw them into the sea. Then, looking more carefully, Carrie saw real jellyfish. She tried it. It tasted great. Carrie was swimming around a colorful coral reef. She saw a crab, and the crab saw her. The crab started chasing Carrie. Carrie swam away fast. She saw a tunnel in a rock. She went into the tunnel. The crab's claws almost got her. Carrie was safe in the tunnel. The crab went away to find other food. After a while, Carrie looked out of the hole to see if there were any other crabs. She did not see any. She started swimming around. Months passed and Carrie got bigger and stronger. One day, while swimming in shallow water, Carrie saw a fishing net under her. The fishing net moved up. Carrie and many fish got caught in the net. She tried to get out through the holes, but they were too small. Then she saw a big hole at the top. She told the fish to swim up, and they did. The hole was getting smaller. Swim faster, Carrie told the fish. They escaped the net, but just barely. Carrie watched out for fishing nets in the future. Years later, Carrie had grown into a full-grown adult turtle with a colorful grown-up shell. She went back to the same beach where she was born. She came back to lay eggs for her own babies. She saw a boy. Scared, Carrie called away as fast as she could. Then the boy put up a sign. The sign said, Do not disturb. Coretta Coretta Turtle Nesting Ground. Carrie back, came back to lay her eggs. When she saw the sign, it made her very happy. She crawled back into the sea, leaving behind her eggs to grow, hatch and grow to do Coretta Coretta Turtles.